So, any change? Diagnosis says he's screwed. He's still a six. I'm sorry, there's no improvement. The TMS worked, she here. We don't know that. Uh, there was radical movement. Which could have been a seizure. It wasn't a seizure, he moved. You have done deep brain stimulation Alex. on patients with Parkinson's and had success. Okay, deep brain stimulation is a highly experimental type. By stimulating parts of the thalamus, you have found that certain patients have been aroused to the point of being unable to sleep. Now with a coma patient, that same procedure could induce waking, right? Keep pushing him, Alex. You've been doing your research. Am I right or not? Is it possible? It's a completely different- Shahir, is it possible? Yes, theoretically, it is possible. But it could cause brain damage, Alex. We could hit the middle cerebral artery, he could bleed out fast, and he could die. You won't let that happen. He responded to the TMS. This is our next move. I want you to book an OR. That's my girl. Charlie, can you look up for me? Now to your left? The other left? Thank you, Charlie. There's nothing wrong with him. I'd say there is, Doc. He doesn't talk. Since the accident? Hasn't said a word. Well, apart from a small contusion on his forehead, there's nothing physically wrong with him. So what? He's just a mute? Mike! Uh, if we could, um... Um, what Charlie witnessed, sometimes after a traumatic event, a child stops talking altogether. So what do we do? There's not much we can do. Just be patient. Do your best to keep him safe and hope he gets better. Increase it to two volts. Two volts. somewhere else we got a house full of people and he just runs off he's six mike what the hell are we gonna do with him oh what kind of question is that beth i loved your sister you hated my sister that's not the point you ready to be a parent i'm not he's my nephew we can't we just scrape by as it is we take charlie and i have to get a second job i can barely keep the one besides what he's weird he is not weird he doesn't talk he doesn't do normal kid things. It makes you wonder if... Wonder what? This is empty. I'm gonna grab another one. I want you to keep going. And if you can't or won't do it, I will find somebody who will, but I'd rather it was you. Now, what part of the brain controls consciousness? Okay, there are several. But in this trajectory, it is the pedicular ponti nucleus. Then let's go there. Alex, because of the location, there's a chance it could kill him. You won't. I've never been that deep in the midbrain before. Then don't say I've never done anything for you. This would be our last chance. Do you understand? OK, 
Okay, I'm setting the coordinates for the PPN. Why am I not waking up? Hey, Charlie. Why don't you want to wake up? Look at that. Is everything okay? No. What? I mean, that is a very strange signal. Are we stopping? No. Shahir, talk to me. Something is happening to the signals in his midbrain. Something I've never seen before. Looks like you've been in quite an accident. Um, get your license and registration, sir. I wasn't driving. Well, I've seen quite a few of these. You're lucky to... You're bleeding. Do I know you? Sergeant Howard. Jimmy. I didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> of course not. No, I just need to ask you a few questions. You have any, uh... Children? No. Good. Because what's out there... Let me tell you. Nothing but backstabbers, scumbags, and lies. You hear that? You're better off coming with me. Alex! No. Nope. You're just tired, Charlie. I am. I know. It's been a long road with no turning back. Where are we going, Jimmy? Home. Time to go home. That's Alex. You come with me, it's the best thing. I have to go, Jimmy. Charlie. I have to go. I have to go.